we miss our daughter so much. Um, it's our house is quiet. There's someone missing, but we try to do the best that we can. We've started a foundation, Christina Taylor Green Memorial Foundation, in her memory, and we've done amazing things. Um, funded a lot of youth programs here in Tucson and Southern Arizona. So we're proud of the work that we're doing uh, in her memory. I went to Newtown um, a few days after the tragedy, and I plan on going back on the 14th, and I plan on supporting the people there and their families and offering them any kind of, you know, uh, support and love and prayers that I can because I live their pain every day and I've gone through it. Our family does own guns. We do believe in the Second Amendment. I don't think our views have changed that much um, since the shooting. We've always believed that people should have a background check. What we've learned in the last two years is that 40 percent of guns that are purchased in the United States are not required to have a background check. So I think that what I've been doing lately is getting on board with Mayors Against Illegal Weapons and making sure that the laws that we have on the books right now are enforced and uh, hopefully in the future possibly have a ban on military style weapons and high capacity magazines because I don't believe those belong in uh, our communities.